In this world, there are good wizards, bad wizards, and all in between. But nothing in this world is greater than the god Ankh Saram, who watches over our world, giving us objectives, rules, and keeping the world in line. Don't anger the god or he will smite you. Welcome to Fairy Tale Origin. Hello there, everybody. Welcome back to some more Fairy Tale Origins, where uh, I got a couple of new guns. Uh, uh, more precisely, I switched out my uh, revolver and my uh, Glock. Or wait, what was it? Uh, uh, which revolver did I have? I had a, I had Magnum before, but I switched it out with a Colt because there's this TV show called. Uh, Supernatural that had and they have this uh, awesome call that can kill anything. I can hear it. Why can I hear a dragon? What the hell? Why in the actual hell can I hear a dragon? What is this? But yeah, pretty much cold can kill anything. The cold can kill anything that stands in its way with one bullet. So uh, this is what we're gonna use to kill the pesty dragons. Okay. Also, I have this Desert Eagle that's pretty OP just to shoot things like that squid right over there. If I miss, I'm gonna. This is gonna be so embarrassing. A head! It's a head, guys! It's a head! Where is this bloody ass dragon? It's annoying the hell out of me. I don't care. It's fine. So, oh, we also have this uh, casting assistant device that we got on the last episode. And uh, actually, uh, what's his name? Um, Panda showed up here. And uh, he, uh, we, me and him, you know, since we're mercenaries. We're like blood brothers and whatnot. We traded some things. I gave him a couple of spawners. He gave me some of this. He even had that. Um, he had this kind of a table um, that also Mev has. Oh, whoops. Uh, Mev showed it to me first, but um, as you can also see, I have tons of bullets. But as I was saying, Mev showed it to me first, and uh, it's pretty OP if you ask me. So, uh, what's called a transmute. I think it's transmutation table. So this is the thing. So to get it, we need a ph Philosopher's Stone, which we can actually make uh, right here. So if I open you up, open you up, pop, boom, Philosopher's Stone, sick. So there we go, we got a Philosopher's Stone, now we just open this up again, we do this, and BAM! We get a Transmutation Table, because it's Obsidian Stone and a Philosopher's Stone, so poop. That's pretty, ooh, what the hell? You drop? I thought I'm gonna lose you, but I don't. Oh, what is this? What is it? What? Oh. Hello? Okay, that's cool. That is sick. Well, now also we have this transmutation table that is overpowered as hell. Because if I put it down, you already saw, since people were here, and uh, I already saw the trans transmutation table, I decided to put a crap ton of stuff in it. So I did. And uh, yeah, there's a lot more stuff that I need to put in it, like... Um, Let's see, I'm gonna put uh, this obsidian inside, I'm gonna put redstone, this diamond, I'm gonna, I'm not gonna put you in there. But I'm pretty much gonna just shuck everything that has this, as you can see, yellow letters, EMC value, as they call it. I'm gonna shuck everything I have inside of that little thingy, and we'll see what happens. Look at that, 800, almost 900,000 EMC in here through all this stuff so that is pretty and it's sorted from what I can tell it kind of sorts it so that's good so anytime we need something like if we when you open the loot bags and we get a lot of stuff pretty much we just throw it inside here and boom boom shakalaka okay let me also uh, get one let me get uh, these boots so I can jump around fast I don't care if they have no protection I don't need no protection on my booties I only need I only need some, uh, what's it called? I only need some, uh, some uh, jumping around. Pop, pop, sick, dude. That's gonna be so sick. So sick, dude. Look at this. Whoa, let's go. Hell yeah. I'm just gonna jump. Oh, if I could avoid fire, that'd be sick. But yeah, we're just gonna jump around. We're gonna keep jumping around and do our thing. You know, it's gonna be pretty cool. I want to grab some redstone, so let, let me get, what if I get a stack of redstone? Ah, sure, why the hell not? So if you throw this on the ground, I saw Dire Wolf 20's uh, survival roleplay, and I just right-click this, boom!
Boom! Look at that. Look at that, we got 64 Psy Dust. That's actually a lot. That is a lot. Press G to use it. Okay, sick. So, tutorial, requirement, level 1. Um, trick, debug, hold shift for more info. For testing, print out the target. Select or caster. Select the person casting the spell. Okay, so, learn. Welcome to the leveling menu. It looks like you've gotten acquainted with your new brand CAD. This menu this menu serves as your school for the mod, and this is your first tutorial. Don't worry, this is the longest one, as it has to teach you the basics. To get our programming spells, you'll need a spell programmer to run your spells. You only need so let's revert this back to Iron Cat Assembly. Let's search for at PSI. There we go. So there's an Iron Cat, Gold Cat, Psi Metal Cat. How do you get this Psi Metal? Psy metal. Is it like I don't, I don't know how to get psy metal. I don't know how to get some psy metal man. Well, I would like the psy metal assembly, but for now we just gotta stick with uh I mean what's the difference between these two? Efficiency per per pot potency. We should get a gold one, right? Now nah, let's keep let's keep the the iron one. Yeah, let's keep the iron one, okay. But there are he said there are a couple of us there's a spell bullet. Okay, that's how you make a spell bullet. Projectile spell bullet. Loop cast spell bullet. Okay, I have no idea what this is. Let's say grenade spell bullet. Charge mine. Okay, so where are the. Oh, these are the cores. Basic cat core. Let's make a basic cat core. So get a couple of you. Um, what's an arm? Okay, yeah, we need to make a basic one. Pop. Give me, a, give me the basic cat core. Wait, if we go inside of the. Where did it, where did my table go? Didn't get didn't I get like a table last episode? I'm pretty sure I got some kind of a table last episode and I put it right there, but it's gone now. So that's sick. All right, now let's put these these two bad boys. Let's put them right. Uh, I'm gonna put them right here. So you there and you there. Boom. So okay, we need a core. We need this thing, whatever the hell that is. Uh, a socket. Okay, let's make a socket too, because what the hell not? We can make it right now, so why the bloody hell not make it? Wait, what is this one? Signaling. Ooh, signaling cat socket. What is it? Large cat socket. The signaling. Oh, wait. Never mind. Yeah, we, we can only make this one, because the signaling one requires. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I was about to say we can make it, but no, we can't. Um, okay, next up, we need the basic, so we can get pretty much all the basic stuff. So let, it, let me get this gold. Yeah, we can get all the basic stuff, so that's good at least. There we got that. Ultra dense. Uh, wait, basic cat battery. White cat. White cat. Yes, I. Yes, I'll take that. Magenta. No, never mind. I don't feel like taking that. Okay. So what is what did it say? Uh, G. Okay. Let's spell bullet. Okay. Let me get like I don't know. Twenty two. Sure. That was a big mistake. That was the biggest mistake of my life. Okay, uh, selector, caster, and uh, trick debug. Wait, what? The number? Tar target. Target's on the left side. Okay. Uh, okay, name. Uh, 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 test. Okay, so now if, if it's working, and I write with a spell bullet. Okay, there we go. We got it in there. So now we just shuck all uh, of this stuff inside here. Okay, that's cool. Um, now I grab this, right? And uh, now I do it again and uh, test. Okay, and now... Uh, oh, what did it do? Why does my shield look like a cat? Oh, that's not good. There we go. Fixed it. Haha. <laughs> okay, but yeah, there we go. We got it. So if we now hold G and we select test. Oh, oh, dude. Oh, dude, that's sick. Oh, dude. 
Oh, dude. Oh, oh. Oh, dude, that's sick. Look at that. We leveled up. Even you can see it even, even on the right side. It says uh, the stuff. Increase. It was 200. Now it's 400. Oh, that's awesome. That's awesome. Okay. Well, we did level up now, so that's good. Uh, you get number and connector. Okay, learn. Let's talk about number per parameter we saw last time. You'll notice that the parameter has an extra option in the center. Then number, right? And I do this. How do I type in the number? I forgot. Three. Okay. So now if I uh, let me just uh, put this inside here. Let me grab this test. Can I like switch this out? Yes, I can. Okay. So if you go right here, right here, get you back. Um, G test. All right, three. Okay, that's cool because now it shows the three on the beginning where before it didn't show. You can see that, right? That's cool. Level 3 requirements. Now we get trick, add motion, and entity look. So we'll learn. Okay, okay. I know what you're thinking. This is boring. When do we start cool stuff? Well, now. It's time we introduce a trick that does actually some sort of interaction with the world. Brings in trick, add motion to this trick. I get it somewhat. So now, if we... Uh, how do we remove this? Um, add motion. Target is on the left. Okay, direction. We need to change this to um, add motion. This is debug entity look. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, let's let's put entity look down here. Entity look. How do I remove this? Oh, there we go. That's how. Okay, entity look. Um, target is gonna be there, and we add a connector like that, and. Uh, Okay, I think that that should work, right? Um, direction down, okay, and speed. We need speed set to uh, number, which he said three, right? He said three. There we go. And the uh, number speed is on the on that side. Okay, cool. So uh, complexity, amount of actions, uh, power of the spell, cost. Whoa, that's big cost, dude. Projection, span width. Okay, cool. Now let's call this leap. Oh, let's get this bullet out of our CAD. Put leap inside there. Pop, pop, pop. God damn it. There we go. Okay. So G, leap. Oh, dude. Oh, dude, that's sick. Even though I wasted all my, uh, all my freaking things. That's sick. Oh. Shit. Oh, dude. That's awesome. Oh, my health. What the hell? What the hell, dude? My health just went down as hell. Why? Okay. Well, that's cool. That's definitely cool. So, yeah. Okay. We got leap spell, I guess, now. Uh, so, that's that's actually pretty dope. I like that. Let's delete all this stuff. There we go. Cool. Uh, that is pretty sick. So we get, ooh, we get explode now. What? That's gonna have to wait for the next episode because we already wasted, um, uh, well, wasted. We already use enough time as it is. Wait before we go. Almost forgot. Our uh, secondary abilities have leveled up since I've been using this shield to defend quite a bit. So if we go right here, check stats. You can see now I'm level seven. Last episode at the end I was level one, but off camera I've been defending like a madman. Now we're level seven. We're almost level eight. Actually, but yeah, so there we go. Now we can actually do uh, we can get Defender Core 2, requires level 3 class. Boom, we can also get this one and this one. Okay, cool. So, what is this? It requires one point spent in tree added spell aid. Okay, um, Defender requires class core Defender plus 5% double strike. What is this? Dodge 2, double strike 2. Health, Shield of Fate, requires 4 points spent in 3, requires aid. Shield of, Shield of Fate sounds cool. 
Okay, uh, what is this? Zeal requires eight points spending tree. Okay, um, dodge. Let's go and dodge two again. Uh, we have six points spent out of seven, and defender score when shield is equipped, you deal more more knockback. Bomb. All right, cool. So there we go. Spellbook. Now we can do some uh, shield of faith and aid. As I was saying multiple times, hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure to hit the like button and subscribe if you haven't yet. And I will see you next time. So take care and bye bye. I'll see you next time with some more Fairy Tale Origins.